Hey Thrivers, this is your girl Jay and today I want to talk about something very close to my heart. How I reclaimed my life after a toxic relationship. It wasn't easy but trust me, it was worth it. If you're going through something similar, this is for you. Okay, before we get started, I just want to say a very big welcome to everyone watching. To my returning thrivers, thank you for being part of this incredible community and for your continued support. And to all the thrivers joining us today, welcome. I'm glad you're here. This space, this is a space where we empower each other to grow, heal, and thrive. Mm. If you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss anything. Anything, I mean, any of my upcoming content. Let's thrive together. Now, let's dive right in. Reclaiming your, reclaiming your life after a toxic relationship is no small feat, but it starts with recognizing your worth. Let me take you through my journey, the struggles I faced, the turning points and how I found my way back to the confident, thriving person I am today. Hmm. For a long time, I didn't even realize I was in a toxic relationship. At first, it seemed like love. But over time, the manipulation, the constant undermining, and the emotional drain started to take its toll on me. I felt like I was losing myself. It wasn't the I wasn't the person I used to be. The confident, passionate, full of life girl. I started doubting my worth. I felt like I wasn't enough, like I was never going to be loved the right way. But deep down I knew this wasn't the life I deserved. One day, I reached a breaking point. I looked at myself in the mirror and realized that I had the power, the power to change. I didn't need to wait for someone to save me. I had to save myself. And that's when everything started to shift. It wasn't easy. But the first step was recognizing that I was worthy of a better life. Hmm. Reclaiming my life didn't happen overnight. I had to let go of the fear, the guilt, and the self-doubt. I surrounded myself with people who lifted me up. I found joy in the small things. Again, writing, creating, and rediscovering my passions. I also had to set boundaries. Real boundaries. I learned how to say no without feeling guilty. I started choosing myself. Every single day. Today, I'm not the same person I was before. I have reclaimed my confidence, my joy, and my sense of self. I am thriving. I know that the best part of my journey is still unfolding. And you know what? 
you can do it. You can do it too. If you are in a toxic relationship or struggling with self-doubt, know this. You are enough. You are worthy of love that uplifts you, not breaks you. Take that first toward, step toward reclaiming your life. You've got this, Thrivers. Thank you for listening to my story. If you're ready to thrive, drop a comment below and let me know what steps you're taking to take back your power. Thank you for watching.